camera. It'd be on camera. <laughs> you, you can go go on the question. I was going to ask, who do you think are the biggest proponents of, you know, you talked about anti-Christian sentiment. Who yeah. are the biggest proponents of that? Well, I mean, there, there are certainly, uh, there's a, a, a feminist, toxic Christophobia emanating from certain sections of the Islamic community that is not being discussed in British society. Um, they, that's certainly a major party in the in, in the sort of Christophobia prejudice that we see. But then second to that, and possibly much more influential, is that amongst the internationalist elites, uh, the sort of liberal progressive do-gooder groups, there is a, an innate anti-Christian narrative that we see coming through the media constantly. So I, I remember I remember just after a terrorist attack, a, 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 an Islamist terrorist attack in London, EastEnders, you know, funded by the BBC, ran a story about a Christian turning to violence and using a pistol. That, that was the way that the, 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 the liberal establishment responded to Islamist terrorism was to suggest that every religion is equally bad and equally capable of, of, of performing the same thing. He's the one that's going to change the whole world. There are tens of thousands. Bob, take care. Tens of thousands. And you, God bless you. And in, take care, Bob. Tens of thousands of Islamist terror plots that have been foiled. And there are tens of thousands that have been carried out globally. If you listened to the liberal narrative and believed it, you would be forgiven for believing that Christians have committed just as many terrorist attacks. Because that's the way they talk about religion. Because in their worldview, ideologically, they can't see a spade for a spade. They look at a spade and they call it a shovel. They, 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 they think that every religion is equally the same, capable of equally the same. And it's utter rubbish. And people buy into this narrative because they think that, that whatever is said on the TV is true. And because it appears on TV, it's true. And we've got to break out of that mindless, sheepish mentality of just believing the narrative that's given to us by the media establishment. I'll answer the question. Thank you. Simple question.